I ordered this UPS from Lazada. This is the ProLink Pro 701 SFC for PHP 1320, excluding shipping. The seller is a member of Plasmall, so we get a one-year warranty, 15-day return, 100% authentic product. This is the most affordable brand of UPS. ProLink is from Singapore. I checked the reviews and there are only few one-star ratings. The product arrived after four days. I have not observed any damage on the product packaging. The seller included the invoice and it was secured by two layers of bubble wrap to protect it while shipping. There are three types of UPS, the offline, line interactive, and online or double conversion UPS. What I bought is the line interactive UPS. It comes with an AVR and surge protection according to the box. The only problem with line interactive is they are not pure sine wave, but only square wave or simulated sine wave, which may lessen the life of your PC power supply when used. The photo from Lazada app is different from what I have received. There should be no three indication LEDs. If you want to read the manual, please pause this video.
testing the product's battery backup without charging it from the outlet. Let us plug the product on the outlet. You need a grounded outlet to be able to plug it in. Suddenly, something inside the product exploded and I don't know what it is. Now, it looks broken and we need to return it to Lazada. I'm scared to try powering it on because it exploded earlier, but I want to know what will happen next. According to the manual, red LED and continuous beep indicates that there is a fault inside the unit. That's why we need to return it to Lazada. To return it to Lazada, you need to request for return or refund using the Lazada app. You need to go to the nearest LBC branch near you, bring the product and show your return request number. I was not charged by LBC when returning the product, they just needed the return authorization number. Now I will go buy another UPS. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe.